So we're ready to test this 6.5 Grendel build. Uh, it's a little bit scary. Uh, <laughs> oh, and um, I'm gonna show you the parts that I have going in here, but you're gonna either have to be a member on YouTube or you can go to our Rumble channel and watch it there where there isn't any restrictions. So you can follow us on Rumble, it's Combat Ready. Actually, no, on Rumble, it's Tactical Weapon is the channel name. I'll put a link in the bottom, just go there. Bye. All right, so now I have two rounds in here. malfunction already mm-hmm this is kind of the problem with this <sighs> well crap all right we're back at it uh, that was a malfunction it, it did not feed all the way into that chamber all right here we go All right, second attempt to try to get this to chamber multiple rounds. We have a malfunction already. Okay, you ready? Okay. Oh, that one did not chamber all the way. Let's get that right there. All right, round three, I increased the gas pressure. Another malfunction. This is, well, that's not gonna work either. This is annoying. So it's just struggling to just feed in general. It does not like the steel casing. So you can see it's gouging up the steel case. It's making it hard. There's another one that was like really bad. It's scraping up and then I think that's what's causing it to no to chamber so there might be something going on with the feed ramp on that barrel so i might need to polish something up or uh, round off some edges to make it work a little bit better so it chambers those better so all right so i switched it out for a heavier recoil spring yep we can tell that's definitely heavier let's see if that fixes it All right, so I was kind of getting ready to give up and I just decided, you know what, what the heck, I'm gonna try it with a suppressor on there. And I was able to get it to run two times, so with two rounds in the magazine. So I'm gonna try to go multiple magazine, I mean multiple rounds and see what happens. All right, so. Maybe I just need to keep increasing the gas pressure on here. Just open that up a little bit more. I thought I had it opened up almost all the way, but maybe not. Then it also brings another question in. Do I need that heavier spring in there at all? So I may switch that back out. So progress.
No, uh oh. I guess it just has to run suppressed, which I don't know if I'm mad about that because I wanted to run it suppressed anyway, but it would be nice if it could be run without it, right? Okay, well, um, that might do it for this version. What do you guys think? Should I try a different one? Maybe try to go with one of the uh, Deadfoot Arms, a little mini short uh, buffer tubes and go that route. Uh, let me know in the comments and uh, we'll see you later.